Dr. Judy, I want a little <laughs> bowl of popcorn, please. Here you go, dear. Oh, I get this whole bowl? Yes. Wow. All right, I'm also, I can't help it because I am like a big kid. <laughs> I'm eyeing these sandwich slices over here. So what, what's our next tip? Okay, so breads like this, if you were to look at home, there's about 20 ingredients in most supermarket commercial breads. Whoa. Whoa. So wow. there's a lot of additives, chemicals, Whoa. dough conditioners, all these things, because this can sit on your counter for a few weeks. Wow. But if you made your own bread or if you bought very short ingredient bread, what happens to it after a week or so? It's green, yep. it goes bad, right. right? So then you want to store it in the freezer after a couple days because frozen bread keeps really, really well, especially if you toast it. That's what I do with mm -hmm. mine. So the fiber will also help with the cholesterol. Mm -hmm. So a lot of these white breads, they take all the fiber out and then they mm -hmm. add sort of fake chemical fiber back in, which mm -hmm. is crazy. So it's not really making sense. So it's and better to have the whole grain. Fiber keeps you full longer mm -hmm. also. So then yes. she's maybe hopefully going to have a decreased urge to snack so much. Mm -hmm. And I always think that it's always helpful to teach them to wait a little bit. Like if they want a second serving, distract them for 15 to 20 minutes. And then sometimes then it kind of settles, the food settles, and they're really not that hungry anymore. And then another great tip is to not eat while you're distracted doing other things yeah. like screens, watching TV, or scrolling through a phone, and that goes for us parents too. <laughs> so we're that. often the worst offenders so scrolling. This really. has been a good segment. Yeah, you guys. <laughs> and what's ironic, I've been eating the whole segment. I haven't even gotten through one bowl. See? It's popcorn, fairly low in calories, a lot of fiber. I feel great. You know, a lot of information. Mm -hmm. I know it's maybe a little too much in one day, but you have a surprise. <laughs> yeah, I do, I have two surprises. So first, I'm gonna work with you for five sessions. Oh. So one-on-one, -on -one. so we're gonna really get you on the right path and continuing all these great choices and changes that you've made. And the second thing, thank you. So there's a little gift basket for you on the end filled with a lot of my favorite Ooh. products. Oh, wow. <laughs> and if you don't mind, there's a little apron for Faith at the end too. Oh, it's really cute, cute so she can help you in the kitchen. Oh, oh queen of everything. Oh, I love that. <laughs> you should model it for us, Dr. Orden. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. I love okay, this. Wear this. She's gonna help. And I love the overall message here is keeping food <laughs> positive. And, and I love all of these substitutions. Jeanette, thank you for sharing your story. Yes. And we wish your daughter nothing but the best. And I like the apron look. Yeah. I think she's going to like that as well. And all the moms out there that are trying so hard.